uh, this is embarrassing. Um, about a mm, probably, oh boy, it's been about 16 years ago. Um, for v the first Valentine's Day, we were together. My wife, my now wife, and I, then girlfriend, uh, Sydney, my now wife. Uh, <laughs> No, you can't. I didn't even open the door to it. That's actually a bat. You have to turn around three times and throw salt over your left shoulder or more. I'll kill you in your sleep. Um, you, I, 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 uh, for Valentine's Day, there was this group that was doing, um, like these sorts of things, but they were, they did a, they called it a VLQ or a very large quartet. And basically, Ooh. A, a just a, a grip of the oldest fellas you've ever seen in your entire <laughs> life show up at a place and sing a song, right? And uh, it was beautiful. It went perfectly. Sydney was at rehearsal for a play, and like they showed up at rehearsal and just like dazzled, and it was very romantic. And I was like, it was really lovely. Um, about six months ago, I started <laughs> thinking. Did I pay those guys? <laughs> oh, it was no. not a money up. Hold on. <laughs> no, don't rush to judge it. It was not a money up front kind of deal. It was, you know, you know, you do it and, you know, make a little deposit and uh, then we'll we'll do the singing and you can make it right later. Um, That's and a then bad I realized, model, old That's dudes, by the good. way. Yeah, but they're they're so old and trusting. So I did this, and I got to thinking about six months ago. I never paid these fucking guys for this thing. Oh, and then I started thinking, like, I gotta make this right. You know, uh -huh. I can get it liquid. I can get it liquid. Get it liquid however, dude, much get it wet. I can get it liquid. However much it costs. And then I started thinking, and this was unpleasant to consider, but most of those guys are probably. Um, but a lot of them are probably dead. And that is when I started to feel really bad. Because at this point, I'd be paying money to, like, their their sons. Their estates. Their singing sons. Right. Their estates, right? Yeah. Kicking in a few bucks here and or there. Or it might be a tontine situation. Yes. Where the very large quartet has just been saving all the money that they make. And the last one kicking, which will probably be the baritone, I mean, they, let's be honest. All, the only source of income the surviving members of this group need to worry about is Justin's unpaid deposit plus the juice. Oh yeah, the juice has been flowing. My man, it's it we're talking six figures, bud. Yeah. Their pay their their page is still active. I mean their website is still active, but there's no online option. So I would have to come like I would have to make a phone call that's yeah. like Hello, this is Justin McElroy. You probably know me from how they talked about me at the meetings for a decade. But like, how's the juice right now? <laughs> Do you want us like, to sit what's... here on the phone, like on the call with you while you call them? Like, we'll be here for emotional support if you want. Oh, that could be really good. That would be like a really special thing for the Max Fun Drive episode. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> All right, but hold, hold on. on a second. This can't be like our prank episode, Travis. You and I have to button it the fuck up, dude. Yep. Yep. You, you guys yep. talk about that for a second while I uh, while I do this. And let's have Justin do a very good phone call while me and Travis really button it up. Hello. Uh, hi. Uh, I had a question regarding the Thundertones. Yes. What would you like to know? Well, okay. Um, I didn't think anybody would, would answer, uh, but so I'm a little nervous. But um, in I, – I, th I think it was <laughs> – No reason to be nervous. You well, you haven't heard. Okay. So in 2005 um, – you all did a singing telegram for my uh she was the my girlfriend then and she was my she's my wife now uh she was very touched by it and i realized about six months ago that i never paid for it and i feel really really bad about it and i have for quite some time and i know that there's juice on it i know the interest has been collecting for many years i'm sure you all have been talking about it a lot and i just wanted to make yeah, it right that's, and that's get, that's it's up to three thousand dollars. No, that's not true. Um, we, I don't, I was not in the group at that time, and I don't even know what kind of record. We, I, we don't have any records. I don't think that go uh, that far. Or if they do, they, they we do. They're so buried. Um, I, I will tell you this: if uh, if you want to um, make that right, just so your conscience will be uh, soothed, you may send a check. Um, let's see, 2005. I don't. Do you remember how much it was for? Because it's now fifty dollars. I don't know what they were back then. 
I mean, fifty dollars sounds that sounds more than fair. There was a whole lot of people there. I mean, just, there was a, a a a VLQ they called it a very large quartet, which is a good joke. Oh, okay. And um, okay, I, fifty dollars sounds fair, but if you want it to be more, I mean, I feel so terrible. You really got me over a barrel on this no. one. No, not at all. I appreciate your honesty, and that is no problem at all. Uh, why don't you just send a uh, a fifty dollar check? to the Thundertones, make it out to the Thundertones. Okay. And just send it to my to my address. I'm the president of the group. My name is but you don't need to know that. Just just make out the check to the Thundertones and then my address is as follows. Uh, well thank you so much. Uh, I I really appreciate you letting me get my conscience clear. I feel like a, a new chapter has begun. <laughs> And I'm ready to move forward uh, with with a clean conscience. I mean, for this, there's lots of well, other congrats. terrible things, but <laughs> for this one thing, I feel I was going to say, I was going to say, now you can go back and return all those books that you checked out of the library that you never returned. So, uh, <laughs> so that. <laughs> well, so thank you very much for your patronage. Uh, uh, by the way, we just finished that up, and uh, we we did 38 uh, Valentines this year. Had two quartets go out. It was very successful. Uh, keep us in mind for next year. And I'm sure that she wouldn't uh, remind a reprieve uh, on something like that. I love that you can trust me again. I History, uh, you know, is not on my side. I'm, I'm impressed that you're willing to forgive and forget. Well, that is no problem at all. I, I, I wasn't expecting it in the first place. And like I said, we don't have a record of it. So don't worry but about hey, you that. You all must, okay? must be rolling in it now, though. 38 times 50. I'm loving that math. Well, I tell you what, it is It is our largest fundraiser. Uh, even uh, we make more off this than we do even our annual show that we do in the fall. Is we that one spookier, kind of a scary, scary thing? Lots of like haunted jump scares and stuff like that we did no no we did one of those we did a show that was kind of had that theme but no it it varies from year to year and recently we've been going with with songs that are songs that everybody's familiar with uh this last one was the british invasion and we did a bunch from uh uh, beatles and and uh, herman's hermits and uh, stuff like that so it's a lot of fun and if you sing heck Come by and see us. Okay, uh, I'll give you just a sample and you let me know what you think. Stay a while with me. Just stick around and see what happens. What will be, will be. And we'll we can work with that. Yeah, we can work with that. That's excellent. Hey, uh, Rick, you've been so cool. <laughs> Thank you so much. My my brothers put me up to this. I, I told them this story and they forced me to call for our uh, our podcast uh and you will uh that check will be rolling your way uh here in here in a couple of days tell me your name justin mcelroy justin mcelroy well thank you very much justin i'll look forward to that that check and 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 that amount and also give me give me your contact information as well yes i'm at th- now you're this is for the lawsuit isn't it because i've had the juice running too long <laughs> all right thanks rick okay. take, take it easy Okay, you too. Thank you, Justin. Appreciate it. Bye bye. No, 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 no. You just got pranked, baby. I can't believe they had forgotten about it. No, Justin, they didn't. I can't believe Rick acted like he had forgotten about it so convincingly. Yeah, and did you also hear how when you gave him your name with a little bit of a smile as if he was then going to be like, oh, damn, Justin McElroy, and then there was no recognition at all, and I oh, got I didn't think it was down my I didn't spine. Think, I didn't think he'd be like, oh, shit, Justin McElroy from podcast. I literally thought it, but he was looking for a list of, like, shitheads. Yeah. I, I expected him to remember me from the shithead list. Yeah, when you said for, Justin McElroy. What do you McElroy. think he's a fucking things I bought at Sheets fan? <laughs> <laughs> he, 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 that's I, I was expecting Rick to be a fan of my, my YouTube series. Come on. When you said Justin McElroy, he just reached over to the notepad in his passenger seat and marked off your name under people I need to kill. Yeah. 
there's also we're he's he's from Huntington. If I said my name, it was not that he would know me. It was probably that thinking that he'd know my dad. Yeah, and would say like, "Oh, this fucking figures." Yeah. Hey, you're gonna like bleep out his address and stuff, right? So we don't. Oh, dox I it. hope so. I hope so. Ooh, I hope so. But sometimes Ooh. I don't pay very close attention to these, don't I? Hey, maybe you- this could become like a new segment where Justin just clears his conscience, like one. Ooh, one bad thing cleaning out the closet. I like that. Only, yeah. only bad thing I ever did, though. Well, That's the only well, one. Okay. Uh, hey, I've got a Yahoo here. Do you want to hear it? 